gotta get my fans up on me. They dig them up. They put in on the cell. I'm thinking about Trey. I'm gonna go dig them what's good youtube it's your boy charles 2k coming back to you guys with another video and as you guys can see from the title of today's video i'm back with more prize picks for today's game slate on monday february the 27th and as always if you guys are new to prize picks or you guys are new to underdog and you guys would like to sign up you guys can check out the pinned comment down below with my referral code this code will match whatever you guys do decide to deposit on the app up to a hundred dollars with a minimum deposit of ten dollars so if you guys are interested you guys can check that out and as always before we do get into the new picks of today's video we must recap the ones from yesterday so yesterday we had clinton Capella over 10 and a half rebounds. He gave us what I projected, which was 12. We had Domitius Sabonis over 13 and a half rebounds as well. He gave us 15. And unfortunately, we would have had the full sweep, but Luca and the Mavs just completely sold. They could not hit a shot to save their lives in that second half. So we ended the day two out of three. So if you tell any two of those other picks, congratulations on cash. Now with all that being said, now the way, let's go ahead and get into the first pick of today's video. Now you guys know it's not that many games today. So in today's video, it's only going to be a two pick, a two man power play. But the first pick of today's video is going to be Jason Tatum over 44 and a half PRA. If I do open up Jason Tatum stats over the last five games when it does come to PRA, against Philly, he had 37, which he really didn't do anything at all. Against the Pacers, he had 50. And now you guys know when it does come to the All-Star game, I don't count that at all. But against Detroit, he had 54. And against the Grizzlies, he had 26. And now if we do head over to statmuse.com and we look up some information. So in today's game, there is going to be no Jalen Brown, okay? So Jalen Brown will not be playing in this game today. And if you do search up on statmuse, Jason Tatum stats without Jalen Brown this season. He is averaging 34.2 points, 8.7 rebounds, and 4.9 assists in the last 10 games without Jalen Brown this season. And that is a 47.8 PRA. Also, if we do head over to bettingpros.com to check the matchup tonight for Jason Tatum, the New York Knicks are allowing 24.2 points, 7.85 rebounds, and 3.9 assists to the small four position this season. Also, if we do head over to props.cash and we take a look at Jason Tatum's PRA over the full season, season he's averaging 43.8 out of his last 10 he's averaging 41.6 out of his last five he's averaging 43.2 and versus new york he is averaging 44 and now i know you guys might be saying all of that red but here's where it does come in at where i do like to play once again on props.cash you can look at player stats without certain players in the game so if we do go over there to it and we click on jalen brown's name over the full season or over the last you know games without jalen brown Jason Tatum is averaging 44.5 PRA out of his last 10 games without Jalen Brown. He's averaging 47.8. And out of his last five games without Jalen Brown, he's averaging 46.4. And when it does come to breaking down the New York Knicks defense, they are ranked number nine in points allowed. They are ranked number 14 in rebounds allowed. They are ranked number 11 in assists allowed. And they are ranked number three to the power forward defense. Now, I have no idea why uh, Props.Cash got Jason Tatum listed as a power forward. He is not a power forward, but you guys get the gif. And uh, yeah, that right there is going to be all my reasons behind why I do love Jason Tatum to go over 44 and a half PRA tonight. I expect him to get at least 46 to 47 PRA. And now for our second and final pick of today's video, we are going to be going with Wendell Carter Jr. over eight and a half rebounds. And if I do open up Wendell Carter Jr. stats over the last five games when it does come to rebounds, against Indiana, he had 11. Against Detroit, he had 14. Against Toronto, he had six. Against Chicago, he had seven. And against Miami, he had six. Also, if we do it over statmuse.com, and we look at Wendell Carter Jr. stats over the last five games against the Pelicans, Wendell Carter has gone over eight rebounds once twice three four out of the last five times they did play and uh one of those times he did hook at the, that eight right there so tonight i'm expecting him to give us at least 10 to 11 rebounds with ease also if you guys do head over to hashtag basketball another great site if you want to look up matchups and stuff if we go over to the new orleans pelicans and we type all positions and we go to the center position they are allowing 25 points this season when it does come to the rebound they're allowing 15.4 and when it does come to assist they're allowing 4.0 to the center position this season also, if we do it over to props.cash, if we look at Wendell Carter's stats over the full season when it does come to rebounds, over the full season, Wendell is averaging 8.7 rebounds. Over his last 10 games, he's averaging 9. Over his last 5 games, he's averaging 8.8. .8. And versus the Pelicans, he's averaging 9. And when we do break down the Pelicans' defense when it does come to rebounding, they are ranked number 8 in rebounds allowed. They are ranked number 12 in offensive rebounds allowed. They are ranked number 11 in defensive rebounds allowed. And they are ranked number 14 to the center defense. And that right there is going to be all the reasons why I do love Wendell Carter to go over 8.5 rebounds tonight. And now, Wendell Carter was in a rebounding slump, but these last two previous games, he has been rebounding very, very efficiently. So I expect that to continue tonight, especially with the matchup that he does have. And uh, those are going to be our two picks for today's game slate, which is Jason Tatum over 44 and a half PRA and Wendell Carter Jr. over eight and a half rebounds. Also, if you guys want more picks or you want to discuss more picks, you guys can join my Discord. That is in the pinned comment down below. It is 100% free. I don't charge for no plays at all. All you guys have to do is click that link and join. But other than that, don't forget to drop a like on today's video 
bell and don't forget to turn on those post notifications it is me your boy charles 2k i will catch you guys in the next one i'm out peace